This one's a T6, and this one's a T8. Now they usually hide one under the stickers, and it's always annoying to find. That looks interesting. Where'd that come from? So these are diametrically opposed magnets and that's how this thing moves from side to side. So this, this here attracted to here, this here repelled from here. So like the north's here and then the south's here. It's probably going to be the opposite, or the, no, it's going to be the same. That's some type of interface. Okay, and then the thing that was holding the disc in is this screw right here. Somehow I want to get that bearing out because I want it. Okay, let's go over what we got today. Uh, about 95 magnetic all, even though they can hold all that data. Four of these 25 diameter, 95 outer diameter. We got these, not sure what to do with these. We got 25, 32. Okay, we got two diametrically opposed magnets. All right, and then this one, I think it's going to be, this feels like almost like plastic. That's metal. Super light feeling to it. Let's see, 32 and a half. First I'll get these organized, then I'll measure them. Fifteen, yeah, it looks like they're M3 nuts, I mean screws. So, 15 M3s. Um, they seem a little big for M2s. Yeah, so these, some of these are M2s. So these are a little bigger than M2s. Oh, two bolts, 12 screws of varying sizes. And I don't know if I'm gonna get everything out of here, but I do have this motor that I could take out if I knew how. The Forbidden Jutsu spinning hard drive. And then this is just some thick metal. 